What's up guys, welcome to Apex, thanks for tuning in. In today's video, I have got a fantastic Android application for you guys, which offers some amazing iOS widgets. And most of the widgets on this application are available for free. And you can download this application on any Android phones you want. Moreover, you don't need KWGT app to apply these widgets on your home screen. So it's an absolutely free application available on Play Store. This is called iOS widgets. And as the name suggests, these are all iOS widgets that we have here. As you can see, this is a beautiful looking calendar widget we have here. When you tap on that, it is going to take you to the default calendar app that you have on your phone. And the next one we have here is the Google search widget. Uh, it's designed pretty well. As you can see, when you tap on this, it's going to take you to the search bar. Then we have got this informational widget here for battery information. It's going to show you the battery percentage and it also has a bar which is going to tell you how much battery is left here. Then we have got this another informational widget here which shows the memory information. Uh, it's about the RAM that it is showing you here. As you can see we got this used RAM and available RAM and it also shows a beautiful graphical representation of this available and used RAM. Then we have got this widget which is of course a rectangular widget. Uh, in fact all these widgets you can increase or decrease the sizes. You can set it as a square widget or you can also turn it into a rectangular widget. Of course all of them come with this rounded corners. Now coming to this widget here we have got uh, the search bar we have chrome play store and gmail access uh, you can directly tap on these to get a quick access to these applications that's another interactive widget we have here now going to the next home screen we have got this storage information we have got this available storage use storage and total storage information here on this widget and then we have got this beautiful looking clock widget which also has this seconds hand graphics uh, it's an active second hand which we have on this particular widget then we have this uh, music widget we, we can just tap on that to go to the corresponding music application of course you can select the application that you want for this particular widget then we have got another interactive widget here uh, we can set four different contacts on this widget to get a quick access it's more like a speed dial widget uh, you can just tap on that particular contact that you have selected to directly go to the dialing pad and call that particular contact here we have some other informational as well as interactive widgets. We have got moon phase widget here. So if you follow moon phase, uh, you can set this up on your home screen. We've got another Google search widget. We've got a toggle widget here. We can access Wi-Fi, Bluetooth, data usage information, and uh, we can also turn on or turn off the flight mode here. And then we have got this calendar widget. When you tap on that, it's going to take you to alarms. That's uh, kind of strange. It should have taken you to the uh, calendar, but somehow it is taking you to to the alarms that's another widget we have here so apart from these widgets if you want some premium widgets they are also available on this application uh, there are some more interactive and uh, informative widgets which are available so if you are interested in upgrading it you can do that as well now coming to the widget app itself uh, there is nothing much going on in there we have got all the list of widgets available here and we got some tips to apply the widgets on the home screen so to apply it uh, you can just press and hold on this particular app icon you will see this pop up here where you can see an option to select widgets just tap on widgets uh, we have all the widgets available here you can select whichever widget you want and just tap on add to add it on the home screen another way of setting these widgets is just press and hold on the home screen uh, you have widgets option just tap on that uh, search for ios widgets and then select the widget you want. So these are the two ways you can use these widgets. So it's a fantastic application which offers some amazing crisp and clear interactive widgets which are available for free. Of course, most of them are available for free. The download link for this particular app is in the description. You can go ahead and check it out, download it, and do let me know what do you think about this application in the comment section below. If you want to watch more cool contents like this, make sure you subscribe and become a part of Apex community. And don't forget to smash that like button. That's all I have here in this video for you guys. Thanks a lot for watching. I will see you tomorrow. You guys take care and stay safe. Cheers. Bye-bye.